Okay, they want to know here what is the solution for 5 over x is equal to x plus 13 over 6. I multiply everything by 6 and I get 30 over x equals x plus 13, right? These 6s cancel out over here. Now I'm going to multiply everything by x. And what am I going to get? On the left hand side, the x's will cancel out, so I get 30. On the right hand side, we have x times x plus 13. So now, um, to distribute the x, we get x squared plus 13x equals 30. Notice we have that x squared and 13x structure. We're going to solve a quadratic by subtracting 30 from both sides, which is an uncomfortable move at first because for students here we get 0, but that's okay. 0 equals x squared plus 13x minus 30. So what factors uh, multiply to sorry, to negative 30 and add to positive 13. Well, I know that 15, positive 15, times negative 2 does just that. So here, we're almost done. But our factors, you know, this shows us that x could equal two things. Well, if this equals 0 and x is negative 15, this first term would equal 0. So x could be negative 15. Or if x was 2, right, we get 2 minus 2, which would be 0, and it would also fit this, so x could also equal 2. Or x equals 2. Now we're going to lose one of the choices, though, and that's um, negative 15, choice 4.